Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Somewhat There. Today I'm going to show everyone how to actually service a bearing. So here on the table are actually the stuff that you need to service a bearing. First is this uh, LA40 from Nava Cam. Uh, you can use uh, WD40 as a replacement also, as long as you can lubricate and prevent rust at the same time. You need a plastic container. The plastic container is to actually put your bearing inside and then you can spray this chemical inside. This uh, pin is to actually remove the C-clip from your bearing so that you can actually service the ball bearings inside the bearing. Last but not least, you need a 3-way tool. The 3 way tool have uh, three different uses. One is the screwdriver, one is the Allen key, and one is this round thing to actually remove the bearing. So let me show you how to remove the bearing. Just put this inside the bearing and do this rotating motion. Okay, then out comes the bearing. So as you can see, this is a bearing. The bearing actually, there's a way to remove it. It's actually using this pin to trace the C clip. Okay. Once you have reached the head of the C-clip, there's two sides, one side cannot remove, use the other side, okay, just actually need to use the pin to take it out, okay, so out comes the C-clip, okay, do not lose this because you will need to put it back later, then just use the pin in the middle, take it out. Okay. So here it is. So as you can see inside of the ball bearing there are actually lubricate inside. Some lubricant, some oil and also a lot of dust. So a standard bearing inside have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 seven ball bearing inside. So actually you can remove both side. Remove both side and put it in. Next use the solution Give it a shake, give it some distance and you spray. Spray in a circular motion, make sure all the ball bearings are being sprayed. Don't go too close because the chemical is actually poisonous. You can use the 3 2 to actually flip it. Okay. And give it a spray. That will be enough for one bearing. And then, take the bearing out. And put it on the cloth. Use the cloth and dry it. Okay, so this is a service bearing. You can see a lot of dust are being washed out by this uh, L840. And this will actually lubricate the bearing. It's now much more smoother. Okay, as for putting back of the ball bearing, you can actually only put one side. Just put this, the seal, just put the seal back in and put the C-clip on. The C-clip is relatively easy to put on, just actually squeeze it in. Very simple. Doesn't matter left side or right side. Okay, so for the surface of the bearing, because one side of the bearing is actually inside the wheel so it won't collect any dust so you only need to put one side but you can also put back two sides if you want but for me one side will do and I will just put it back inside and there you have it, that is how you service a bearing okay so in the market you will see these three common types of bearings First one is the one that I just serviced is the C-clip bearing with the aluminum seal. Another type you will see very commonly is the rubber seal bearing. This one is quite easy to take out. You just need to put it between the bearing and the seal. And it will just come out. Okay, out it comes. Very simple. Putting back is also very easy. Just actually squeeze it back in. The last one we have here is the factory silk bearings. So for this type, there's actually no way to service it. If you need to service it, means it's time to change it. So just throw it in the dustbin and buy a new one. 
Customization of the skates. You can actually start from the customization of the boot, which is the overall color, like the overview of how the skate will look like.